Hi everybody, it's Bexy from rhinestonecraftsupplies.com. Today I am doing a tutorial to show you how to make an iron-on hotfix transfer using our DMC crystals. These crystals have a specially formulated adhesive backing which is heat activated which allows you to iron on these stones to your garments without using glue. And we're also going to be using our Mylar Hotfix paper. So the first thing we have to do is print out the image that you want to create. I'm doing writing, so if you are doing writing it is important that you print the writing backwards. You can do this using Photoshop. And you can find fonts on Google, but make sure that you search for free fonts, otherwise you could get into trouble for using them. Okay, so first things first, you take your hotfix paper and you peel it away from, you peel the transparent side away from its backing. And you want to discard the backing, leaving yourself with just the transparent sticky side. And then you place it over your image, or your writing, sticky side up. This is so that you can stick the crystals to it. I'm just going to secure it with a little bit of sticky tape so that it doesn't move around. There you go. Okay, for this I'm actually using our rainbow DMC crystals. These are my favourite. And the sparkle on these is amazing. Okay, <clears throat> so now I'm going to start placing my crystals. I'm using SS10, SS16, and SS20. And I'm going to start placing the crystals onto the sticky paper upside down. And you'll see why I'm doing this in just a moment. As you can see, I'm using my Crystal Katana tool for this. These are available on our website and they just make picking up the stones a lot easier. So I'm just going to place a few more crystals and then I will carry on doing it off camera and then I will show you the next step. Oops. Okay, I'll see you in a minute. Okay, so now I've placed all the stones and I'm happy with the layout. I'm going to take the back of the Mylar paper that we discarded earlier and I'm going to replace it so that I can safely transfer my design to the ironing board. Gently press it down. So that it all sticks. Okay, it's the moment of truth. And there we have our design. Okay, so I am now going to transfer this over to the ironing board ready to iron onto my hoodie. Okay, so I've now placed my design onto my hoodie and I'm happy with the position. So now I'm going to apply heat. Make sure your iron is on full power and you just place it and apply pressure. You're going to need to do this for around about a minute in each section. This will heat the adhesive on the back of the stone and it will set nicely into the material. So I'm going to carry on doing this 
And once I've finished, I'm going to let it cool down before I take the sticky paper off. So now I have finished applying all the heat, I am going to very gently peel away the mylar. Just to see if they have all stuck. If any do come away, simply replace the mylar and give it another go over with the iron. And there you have the design.